Hello everyone and welcome back to Walcott Fine Art. In today's video I'm going to show you how I have the lighting set up in my studio since I've gotten several requests from viewers to show how I've got that set up. So let's take a look. So here is my studio and you can see the basic layout of it. And this room has a big uh, light on the ceiling which is great for you know if I'm working at the computer or just organizing my paints or cleaning. Um, so that provides my normal lighting, but when I'm painting, I'm actually working, I like to keep that light turned off so it doesn't throw too much ambient light around the room. So you'll see over here, I have my easel. And normally when I'm working, I've got the painting up here on the easel, and then I pull this drawer out and I put my palette on there. So the palette and the painting are lit by this clip lamp that I have set up here. Now this is just a, clip, a cheap clip lamp I got at Home Depot and I have a big um, bright LED floodlight in there uh, that is uh, daylight temperature. So that way that lights my painting and my palette so that those two things while I'm working are under the same lighting condition. So I'm not changing, when I go from the palette to the painting, the light is not changing. So that, I find that convenient to have it like that. Now I have another work light up there clipped uh, over the window, but I usually don't use that while I'm working. Uh, that's just, you know, uh, to, if I need more light in the studio while I'm doing other things. Uh, and then over here, I have this other desk lamp uh, over here on this box. And this is where I actually shine the light into this shadow box that I built for my still life painting. Now I'll do another video in the future um, on how I made this, uh, so you can see that. But for today, I'm just talking about the lighting. So this uh, desk lamp, which I got, I think at Target, uh, I have this gel on it, uh, and I'll put a link uh, down in the video description on where you can buy these gels. Um, so there's just a regular bulb in there, and then the gel actually converts it into a daylight temperature, uh, which is really, convenient and it works really well. So it looks like light coming in from a north light window. Uh, and then this shadow box that I have for my still life, um, this just, this piece, it's probably hard to see. This piece allows me here to, I can move that, which helps me control the angle of the lighting. Um, and, or I, or I can move this desk lamp further or closer from this shadow box to change the angle of that shadow that falls across. And then I can set my still life up in here and it's lit by that spotlight. So that is the basic setup that I have for the still life where I actually set the still life up. And then this other setup over here that actually lights my painting and my easel while I'm working. So I hope that helps you, gives you some ideas for lighting your own work area. And I thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Take care. Thanks so much for watching. Go ahead and click on that subscribe button so you won't miss the next video. And why not spread the joy? Be sure to share my videos on your favorite social media. Don't forget to head on over to my website, walcottfineart.com where you can see my art, read my blog, or when you join my newsletter list, you can win free art. Every month, I'll choose a lucky winner for my email list, and that person will receive a mini original oil painting. There's a chance to win every month, so be sure to sign up today so you don't miss out. Plus, you'll get my fun newsletter. See you next time!